Jane's digital dive add mills to the growing list of things that are disappearing from store shelves. And you may have seen videos circulating online of farmers dumping milk. So what gives? Well, it turns out it's not because of a short supply, but a very different problem dairy farmers are now facing over in Wisconsin. Right now in the dairy industry, demand has shifted from cheese, which has been primarily sold in restaurants, to bottled milk. In the state of Wisconsin, about 90% of the milk is made into cheese, 10% is fluid. That's according to Marty Hallock, who milks cows near Mondovi, Wisconsin, and serves on the board of the Ellsworth Cooperative Creamery. He tells us cheese plants like Ellsworth aren't set up to bottle milk and bottling plants only have capacity to bottle so much. Nobody wants to dump milk. Somewhere there's a line that made them little butter patties that's sitting empty right now. Because they went to restaurants. They went to restaurants. Ellsworth Creamery is working overtime turning milk into stored cheese. Even still, they sent out this letter urging his farmers to cut production through cow sales and feeding changes and even offering financial incentives to dairymen who quit. It's all meant to stave off milk dumping. Now, in a letter, Wisconsin's congressional delegation urged the Secretary of Agriculture to step up government purchases of cheese for food shelves. And there's no word on that just yet, but hopefully, Chris, some changes are made here in the future. Yeah, it just seems that dairy farmers can never catch a break. Right. Thanks for shedding some light on that, Alicia.